Okay, so some kits are bigger than others. As you can see, it's bigger than the top of the dryer. This is the 172nd scale Space Shuttle Orbiter. And I'm shooting this video because Model Man Tom had just bought the 172nd scale Orbiter and boosters, which is, is just huge, because this is huge, and it, it would be bigger than that because of the tanks and the... And, uh, uh, like two and a half feet tall I think is what he said but I am shooting this video because of a kind of a curious thing now this one came out in uh, where is it I thought I had read oh there it is up there 2001 so this is 10 years old. 10 years ago, it seems as though they molded it just a little bit different. Because Model Man Tom is saying that they don't have all these tiles on his kit, which, I mean, it was expensive. It should have that detail. And I was saying, well, you know what, I think, I think the one that I have from the same company, Ravel, I was saying I think that this one does have the tiles and so you have already peeked in here and yeah sure enough if you look there there's your tiles all over the tail there's uh, not too much on the side of the orbiter but they're there and the nose and everywhere and uh, on the wing edge you got the right arrangement and then on the, uh, the bottom you can see that's a, kind of a big Thing. But yeah, the bottom's got got it all done the way it's supposed to. And I've seen the real shuttle. I'm here in Florida. I'm right down the road from Cape Canaveral. And this is the way the belly looks. And yeah, just an immense number of tiles, and they're all raised lines. But, um, so, it, it's uh, bewildering. Um, for some reason, the new edition Orbiter that comes with the boosters, same company, they, they removed the tiles. Which doesn't make any sense at all. I mean, I think that that would even be hard to do on the mold or something. Maybe the mold broke and they had to make a new one or something like that. But yeah, Tom was mentioning he might want to just buy this one for his uh, boosters and fuel tank. And uh, so just show him what's here. Basically, you know, there's the uh, window pieces are nice and tinted. And then, yeah, they're, both parts of the window are there. And yada yada yada. Da, 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 da. I did start on it there and this is I've kind of this is the uh, you know the payload bay and I got all the doors out but I didn't really do anything with them yet there's the little there's the uh, rudder and the other wing as far as I know it's, it's complete there's a decal sheet on this one. He was he was talking about the decal sheet only shows maybe one variety. This one does have four. Um, no Enterprise on this one. And no Challenger. So, I mean, anyway, it's decals. And it's got all the, you know, 
landing gear and this is meant to be just a you know you can pose it in flight or on the ground with the wheels down booster anyways. There we go. Pretty cool. And yeah, I know. Is there the other? Clearly one missing. But is it in the box somewhere? Yep, it's down here. There's the missing booster. Or um, engine. And yeah, I did start on this a little bit. Um, I was just working on the, on the, uh, cockpit. I think I was doing pretty good. I think that's the right color. And I got the decal in there. But anyway, this is, and it's got the, you know, European laboratory um, stuff, and, you know, the uh, control arm or whatever. But anyway, yeah, I mean, you, here's a good look at, you were mentioning, Tom, that the big pieces aren't going to go together very well, or they're going to be tricky. And here's an indication. I did try to glue this together, and it came apart on me. So... Yeah, it's very different from model cars. These really big pieces, it's, I don't know, get, get a, little bit, a little bit creative on gluing. But this is what's here. Uh, if you want it, I've got another Orbiter. I've got the Tamiya Orbiter in the 1-100 scale. So if this one leaves, actually it'll kind of open up some room because this is huge. Uh, but I'll still have an orbiter here, so if you want to buy this, that's cool. Let me know if you if you want this later.